Place metal drip edge at the bottom edge of the eave. Roll out a 36 inch wide strip of peel and stick type ice water membrane at the eave edge, allowing it to overhang the eave by one inch and press firmly in place. Place a 36 inch wide strip of ice water membrane centering it in the valley, pressing firmly in place. Apply a 24 inch to 36 inch wide W or V metal valley over the ice water membrane and nail in place, taking care to keep nails out of the center of the valley. Roll out a 36 inch wide strip of ice water membrane, starting at the three inch mark on either side of the center of the valley and press in place. The ice water membrane ends 39 inches out from the center of the valley. Roll out the underlayment such that there is a minimum six inch side lap and four inch of head lap over the ice water membrane and on subsequent layers of the underlayment. Fasten underlayment using manufacturer recommended fasteners. Place gable flashing on wood deck on gable end and nail in place, keeping nails away from the gable edge. Cut an 18 inch wide strip of ice water membrane and place two inches inboard of the gable edge such that it overlaps the metal flashing and the underlayment on the deck and press in place. Snap a chalk line 12 inches up from the lowermost point of the eave edge. This will serve as a guide for the top of the factory starter strip. Place a 36 inch wide starter strip on the deck with the top of the starter strip lined up along the chalk line. Cut a minimum of six inches off the left side of the starter so it is offset from the first panel placed over it. Refer to page 18 of the installation guide for a detailed layout. Nail in place using seven standard inch and three quarter long roofing nails evenly spaced across the starter panel and approximately two inches above the locking tab. Working left to right, place the next starter strip along the chalk line and fit the spacer tab into the receiver so that it just touches. Make sure the top of the starter strip is lined up on the chalk line prior to nailing. Place the first panel of Euro Slate or Euro Shake such that it engages the lock mechanism on the starter strip the full length of the panel. Place nails in the field panel as you did when installing the starter strip. Working left to right, continue to place the nail panels using seven standard inch and three quarter long roofing nails for Euro Slate, six nails for Euro Shake at the target locations indicated by a circle on the panel approximately two inches above the locking tab. To verify panels are properly locked, make sure they can be moved side to side while locked without binding. Make sure the panels do not move or drop down when nailing in place. Hold the panel firmly in place in the lock position while nailing from left to right across the panel. Make sure the spacer tabs on the side of the panel fit into the receiver for proper side to side spacing. Continue up the roof making sure to follow the layout pattern found on the back of the installation guide for panel position. This will help minimize the effect of pattern formation on the roof and will prevent keyways from lining up with the course below. Make sure to leave approximately quarter inch of space between the field panel and the gable flashing from eave to ridge. Install caps on hip or ridge using a chalk line to keep them straight. Begin by cutting the top section of the cap off and fasten it at the bottom of the hip at the eave edge using three inch deck screws. Position the first cap so that it locks into the starter cap lock and screw in place using four screws placed within half inch on the lock as shown. Be sure not to countersink the screws. Apply a dab of Euroshield sealant to the underside of both hip and ridge end caps and then place a two inch brad nail through the first cap and sealant on both sides. This will provide additional protection against wind uplift. Continue up the roof making sure to keep the caps in a straight line. This concludes the installation video for Euro Slate and Euro Shake. Thank you for watching. Please download and read the Euro Slate, Euro Shake installation guide 
found at euroshieldroofing.com for complete, detailed step-by-step -step instructions. Always follow the layout pattern found at the back of this guide for the mold number marked on the front of the panel for the best installation results.